up, Winnie Nerdigans? This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 Today's Manga Nerdigan Live Reaction video is going to be for Jujika no Roken in Chapter 65. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored. And I'm just a non-stop high-speed struggle train heading into chaos. Mm -hmm. It's getting faster by the second. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive and a kick in, feel free to hit up my Cash App and PayPal. Those links are in the description box below. So fam, finally here. Oh, I'm so excited for this. Last chapter, Ruma did what he needed to do. He cut off, he cut off his bitches. He made it clear. He's like, I'm done. I'm done with all this shit. I can't have any side pieces. I, got, I don't want to put you, you bitches in danger. And I got to focus on the prize. On my ultimate goal. On the motherfucker who fucked me over. And my family over. The mastermind, Keo. And I'm ready for this. Let's get to this chapter. See what's in store for us this week. And this chapter is titled Flawless. There's that bitch. Shigoku Keo, 16 years old. Height 166 centimeters, weight 61 kilograms, blood type AB. He lived with his father who worked for the government and his mother who looked after the house. Wait. Father worked for the government? What part of the government? Because he might have, Keo probably, even, you know, I'm thinking about this. If Keo would have done some shady ass shit, even, hell, even if um, Keo would have gotten busted, for what he did to Aruma's family, Papa probably could have used his connections to get him out. They conducted themselves well, an ordinary family with a good reputation, but born out of mediocrity was evil. Shigoku Kyo was truly a mutation. This family is everything! I feel the evil. I feel the mutation. Yes, I feel it, man. I feel it coming off this panel. I live. He went to uh, Tacey High School, uh, the most advanced school in the prefecture. He was surrounded by his classmates. He was class president. In um, his first year of high school, he ranked number one overall in the Tokyo University mock exam. Ever since then, he was called a prodigy. His athletic ability and reflexes were extraordinary. He set new records uh, records during his school's fitness, fitness test. He played for the basketball team. In middle school, he participated in a national competition where he was scouted for his athletic prowess. He trained in judo since elementary school and became a black belt. He could even um, compete with adults at dojos. He was flawless. His talent knew no bounds. But let's be real. He had some kinks going on up in there. But hold on. Look at them. Look at them waves. Look at them waves in that iris. That is so pretty. But no one's perfect. There's something on going on beyond the, behind them eyes. Ooh, there it is. Shit, I lost him. Permanence and con Continuity of the World Revolution Club, 5th Floor, Meeting Room. Hello, members of the fraternity. I apologize for being late. Whoa, what? I apologize for being late. I couldn't get away from school. Thank you for taking your time to be here today. Now then, let's begin starting with... Man, today was great. Um, it feels like all my worries have been lifted. Goodbye. Goodbye to you as well. Uh... You, for researchers, please stay here. Oh my god. Ando-san, Momoki-san, Anogi-san, Miguel-san. I would like to add someone new to our allies. Come in. She recalled shotgun! Everyone, please teach him lots of things. Dude! Kyo started a cult! This is a cult!
from this is going to be very interesting, but I think the more interesting thing is, is Ke uh, let's go back to this fucking cold here. Hold on. Well, re it's research. Dude, they're cultists. Let's be fucking real. Because Keo, remember what Keo did in the first place when they were kids? Um, Keo preys upon the weak. These are, and these people said, man, today was great. It feels like all my worries have been lifted. Mm -hmm. Where is this? Permanence and con um, Continuity of the World Revolution Club. That's a fucking cult. That is a cult. Is any, are any of you surprised by this? The only thing I'm kind of surprised by is that, like, Kuga and them weren't part of this. Or maybe they were. I'm curious what you guys think about that, think about that in particular. But, whoo! Kia's got a new squad! But, Kakura waking up from this vegetative state. Oh, shit. But, the thing is, is with Kyo, though. Kyo has friends in all the right place. He probably, we don't know if there's government officials up in there either. So if Kyo has friends in all the right places, Kyo could get away with this shit. Oh, damn. So this, may, this makes it even more important for Kyo to die. Like, Kyo's a piece of shit and needs to die anyway. But, god damn. God damn! Like, but the other thing I can't, I wonder is, it doesn't say here, but you gotta wonder, um, as I said earlier, even if he, if, the, if uh, they knew what Ke what Keo did, um, if because his par his dad worked for the government, if, um, if he used his connections to get Keo out of jail, he would get, use it to get Keo out of jail. I'm telling, and based on this, I you gotta wonder what what kind of experiments Keo's been doing. The experiments have gotta have been continuing, but not obviously not on Aruma. They're continuing on other people. Dude. I hope we get more backstory on this. I want to know what Ke I'm hoping next week or maybe within the next couple of weeks, because obviously we got to get the Kakaroo content next week, but I'm hoping within the next few weeks we'll find out what the fuck he has been doing with the, like how this cult got started. Because motherfucker, he has a, he always running a cult. This is a flawless cult. A revolutionary cult. God damn it. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I want to know, again, are you surprised that Keo is running this cult? I'm not. I'm surprised. Like, I'm not surprised. I'm, you know what? I'm not even surprised by how big this cult is. I'm not. I'm surprised Keo's parents are still alive, if anything. But I'm, the other thing I'm kind of hoping to wonder, because we didn't get the answer to this in regards to... Um, to uh anna or not like i'm hoping we were going to get the answers to that but i don't know we'll have to wait and see in regards to that but what do you guys think about what kakaru's role uh role in this is going to be and um and what do you think is going to go down with this cult dude <sighs> kyo's gonna have to kill all of them He's gonna, he's gotta, he's gotta kill obviously the main, main, uh, source of it all, Keo, uh, Keo, but he might have to kill all the motherfuckers. He might, he might just have to burn that whole building down while they're all in their fucking meeting. 
Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdy Gins Inc. You love what I'm doing. I want to help keep this channel alive and kicking so I can keep bringing you more Chichika and Rogan and content. Few ways you could do that. Donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, find me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdy Gins, I'll be seeing you later. Bye.